Well, good morning. It is May the, May the 11th, in the year of the pandemic 2020. Something biblical about that. And I'm sure thousands of years from now, this will be a biblical, biblical event. And, and St. Trump came down from the, the mountain with uh, orders from above. Or something like that. Um, I don't actually consider him a saint. I have to, I, I'll, be, I'll be honest with you. I, I don't put him in that category. However, um, I, I've enjoyed President Obama's description of President Trump's um, handling of the corona pandemic. President Trump called uh, President Obama called called Trump's handling of it uh, a chaotic disaster. A chaotic disaster. That really, that's really sums it up beautifully. And I I, I bet it it must have taken President Obama at least at least fifteen seconds to, to think that one up. Uh, and and then, and then when, uh, in, on, in the tweet world, when they started tweeting back about President Obama's comments, they one one big critic referred to him as well. Barack doesn't understand. Barack doesn't do this. Barack doesn't that. I mean, they they won't give him the courtesy of calling him well, President Obama. No, it's it's Barack. I mean, what other president have we ever dealt with, talked about, where we didn't use President Reagan, President Bush, President Clinton, President Bush, Pres President Obama? We never, never deal with them by their first names out of just respect for the office, respect for the people. I mean, I, I must not, I must admit, I don't have a ton of respect for this president. Uh, I have almost no respect for him, as a matter of fact. Having dealt with him in person in New York on a couple of occasions, in the entertainment world, I uh, have come to see what who he is. And um, here he is running the pandemic operation by letting everybody else do the work. He doesn't want to think about it. He, he doesn't even, I don't think he really understands it. I don't think he truly understands the nature of what he's dealing with. I think he can't handle it. He doesn't know what to do about it. He can't make a wise decision on it because he doesn't understand it. He doesn't, doesn't get it. He doesn't have enough information in his head to understand what the right thing to do is about all this. So give it to the governors. I want to stay home and watch TV. I want to tweet my little heart out and watch TV, and I want to tweet whatever they say on Fox News so I look intelligent, look, I, so I look like I know what I'm talking about. I understand that. I understand it. When, when, you're, when you're a fraud, you're a fraud. When you're a fraud, you're a fraud, da da duty. <clears throat> I get it. Anyway, that's the condition of our country. This morning, Monday, May 11th, in the year of the pandemic, 2020. Speak to you soon.